Hey guys, Tim Little here with Tactical Bassin. I'm out here on Clear Lake, beautiful day. But today I wanted to talk to you guys about uh, something that I feel that every, every angler should have on their boat. It's something that I believe has revolutionized the fishing industry, uh, well, all, all action sports. It's this little guy right here, the GoPro. These things are amazing. They shoot awesome, awesome footage. They got cameras, you know, they can take pictures, seven, 12 megapixels, as, you know, as good as some of the nice DSLR cameras. But uh, more importantly, <clears throat> I wanted to take a, a few minutes and, and uh, cover some of the things that I've learned along the way. You know, Matt and I, we film 99% of our stuff with GoPros. You know, got one here, one up there. Um, but, you know, we've learned some things along the way. And uh, there's some accessories that are must have. You know, all their accessories are, are top notch, they're, they're cool. Uh, I got a lot of them. But I wanted to cover uh, the, the necessities. So, Let's talk about the cameras. Right now they have the Hero 4 they came out with. There's the black, which is the top of the line. The camera's amazing, does some amazing footage, shoots in 4K, uh, anyways. And then there's the, actually the Hero. Uh, they just came back out with the Hero, the, the original one. This is the old original GoPro Hero. Uh, they just came back out with this and it's 129 bucks. It shoots full 1080 HD, 30 frames per second, and I believe it's a seven megapixel camera. I mean, that's great. Every, I mean, anybody can afford that. Um, so the coolest thing about these cameras, and this is, this is me, me speaking, um, it's increased my fishing. Uh, it's, it's made me a better angler. And that might sound uh, stupid, but at the end of the day, when you have went out and you've had a good day of fishing, good day of fishing you caught a lot of fish, uh, you can take that memory card out, plug it into your computer, and watch every fish catch you had. You can analyze your techniques, good and bad. You can figure out, all right, were they eating on the twitch? Were they eating on the hop? Were they eating on the pause? Were they eating on the fall? You can analyze all that stuff when you're off the water. You know, I can, I can remember what casts I made, what bait I was throwing, those types of things. But when you can sit and you can dissect all of your fish catches and the bites you missed and, and everything and sit there on your computer and analyze it, it's, it's great it's great information so getting back to the GoPro I just want to cover a few things real quick that I think that uh, are necessities when when you're gonna video on the water so the first thing is the camera you know we kind of talked about that a little bit uh, the next thing is gonna be the LCD touchscreen backpack so what this is this is a screen that pops right onto the back of your GoPro Without it all, it, all this is, is a camera. You can't see what angle you're shooting at, what's in the frame, anything. As soon as you put this LCD screen on, now you see everything. You see what the camera sees. You can go through, change all your settings. Uh, you can go and delete. You can watch videos. You know, if you, if you have a 45 minute video and you have nothing in it that you want, you can delete it right off of here. And that just opened up 45 minutes of free space on your memory card. You don't have to deal with changing memory cards, all that type of thing. Uh, a must have. It's it sucks at the end of the day when you stick a toad and you get home, you put your memory card in, you watch the video and your head's cut off or, you know, stuff like that. So, a must have the LCD touchscreen. Uh, the next thing that's a must have for me is the frame. Now, when you get your camera, it comes with the hard acrylic uh, case a waterproof and uh, a skeleton that allows for better audio. But I, I like to run the frame. What this is, it's, uh, it's open, both sides. It's got a port on the side to plug in a USB cord, but it's just better audio. Uh, it also allows me to do, let's see right here. This is another must have. Uh, this is not a GoPro product. This is something that you can get on Amazon for like 35, 40 bucks. This is a battery pack. I now can plug in my GoPro using the frame with a USB cord and run it all day. No more charging batteries, no more cameras dying. Hit record and go. It's amazing. Like I said, 35, 40 bucks Amazon. This one's actually made by Limeade. It's got two outputs, uh, one amp and 2.1 amps. You guys can play around with that, but another must-have. 
couple other things real quick. Let's talk about, oh, auto charger. You know, if you guys don't want to run the battery pack, uh, you can go with the cigarette lighter. It it's, uh, plugs into your boat, two USB ports. You can charge your cameras or batteries. Let's talk mounts. A couple different mounts you can get. You know, when you get your camera, it comes with a few different little uh, gadgets for, uh, for playing around with mounts and stuff. But a couple mounts that I think that uh, have been real lifesavers for me. The Jaws Flex Clamp, the Gooseneck, and the Suction Cup Mount. Now what these are, the Gooseneck, when you buy your camera, it comes with Let's see, it comes with these 3M sticky sticky mounts right here. So you peel the sticker off, you can stick them, you know, they're semi-permanent. I got a couple here, one back on my cowling, one up here. It's, uh, you can put them down wherever you want the camera to be. Uh, pretty cool, you play around with different camera angles. But what this allows you to do, this on your boat, all this does is pop right in. Camera sits right up here. Now you can adjust your angle, all that type of thing. It's, it's uh, pretty cool. Uh, next thing, the Jaws clamp mount, same type of thing, but this clamp right here, I'm using it right up there on the on the tripod. It allows you to not have to be stuck to wherever these little sticky things are. You can move this around, put it on a tree, uh, outside of your boat, off your steering wheel. You know, be creative but it, it, it doesn't limit you to the boat anymore. The other one that I really like is the suction cup mount. Now this one is if you don't want to use these guys on your boat, right here. Little spit, you can stick this on the windshields, uh, side of the boat, your cowling, and they, they lock down. I've, I've ran 60 miles an hour and haven't had these things come off. So uh, another, another great accessory. So I hope this video helps you guys out. I know the GoPro thing, the camera thing could be a little overwhelming. I've gotten so many calls, you know, guys getting cameras, that's what they wanted for Christmas. They wanted a GoPro. Now they want to know, all right, now what do I do? What do I need? So that's just, uh, that's the GoPro accessories in a nutshell. Awesome, awesome products. Like I said, I recommend every angler uh, get some kind of camera on their boat. Like I said, for me personally, at the end of the day, when I go and I watch the video, you know, I'll remember what cast I made or I remember where I caught the fish, but it's it's hard when you're catching a lot of fish to, you know, was it on the Twitch or, you know, when do they eat it? How do they eat it? So it's definitely increased uh, my my fishing. Um, I, recommend, I recommend every angler get one. Uh, hopefully this will help you out. Maybe I can shoot a, another video later on talking about the actual cameras themselves, the settings, the functions, all that type of thing. But uh, you're gonna go out, get yourself a GoPro, get yourself, you know, get, get the best one you can afford, but get yourself the LCD touch screen, get yourself the frame, and get yourself a battery pack. They're lifesavers. So I hope you guys enjoy the video. I hope this helps out. If you guys uh, like it, hit the like button, subscribe to our channel. Uh, Matt and I, we put out a video every week on Wednesday. So, hope you guys enjoy the video. Hope this helps your fishing. Good luck out there.